a uh, quick update on some of the other matches. Nine minutes left in JMU versus uh, Townsend. Sorry, it's been a really long day. Uh, looks like JMU might have a slight man advantage over there. JMU still up by one. Uh, looks like Grand Valley took another point uh, from UWP. So that puts Grand Valley up two. Looks like probably ten minutes or so left in that game. Uh, we are working on getting some audio issues sorted out with the UK Central Michigan game. That, excuse me, that stream should be up here again very shortly. But in that game, Central Michigan did just take another point from UK. So the current standings are Central Michigan up two points to zero against UK. Uh, Saginaw, Saginaw Valley up one point to zero against, or sorry, yeah, Saginaw Valley up one point to zero against Michigan State. Uh, JMU up one point to zero against Townsend and Grand Valley State University up two points to zero against Saginaw UWP. Saginaw with three kills in a row. Wow, yeah, and the uh, the Michigan State bench already pretty deep. Very nice push, very nice uh, fake push there. Two strong throws, number 37, number 55. Nice block, nice dodge by 77 for Michigan State. So since I know Spencer's in here right now, Spencer, what should we be watching for from Saginaw Valley uh, in, in both this game and as they keep going on to the tournament? What are the strengths that Saginaw Valley has that's going to help keep them in this tournament and hopefully lead them to victory? So let us know, and uh, we'd love to hear your thoughts. Nice team catch there. Off the, number, off the fingers number 22 looks like Putnam uh, caught by number 37 for Saginaw Valley. Awesome team catch there. All right, for those of you that are interested, we do have the audio issues sorted out, we believe, with the UK Central Michigan game. Unfortunately, it looks like we're running pretty low on battery, so we'll see how long that lasts. Uh, we are running kind of, uh, the obviously, the streaming apps burn through battery quite a bit, so you're going to be juggling devices in between games, so you might see some quality differences in between points. All right. Saginaw Valley definitely commanding this game. Uh, Michigan... Oh, well, and right when I say that, nice catch, followed up by some trash talk uh, from number eight for Michigan State. A lot of intensity from number eight for Michigan State. So audio is fixed for the Kentucky Central Michigan game. So feel free to tune in over there. Uh, we'll try to get some intermittent commentary over there, but this is obviously our much better setup for providing live con Ooh, wow. Nice throw, number 15, team McCumber. Catch. Is that uh, the team catch team off catch. of? Michigan State got a team catch there. Wow, nice. Okay, so Michigan State actually getting back in this game. Nice. All right, Saginaw Valley put another couple of dents, another couple of dents in on Michigan State. If for some reason we do uh, neglect to keep the other games updated, or if there's a game that you want us to watch or go over and, you know, check out for a few minutes, please let us know. We'd be happy to go over and do some checking out on some other games. So please let us know in the chat. Big hit on number 23. I uh, actually helped him out earlier. He was having a little trouble with his right knee. Taped it up for him, but he said he was having trouble moving as quick as he'd like. All right, Saginaw Valley taking a very quick lead this point. Uh, I'm not sure why they're playing as defensively. Uh, they should really try to push this out because we are like, oh, still got nine minutes left. And then a big catch from Michigan State. No. 
another catch for Michigan. Wow, Michigan State staying in it. Spencer, uh, if you have any words of wisdom you want me to pass on to your uh, to your teammates, I'd be happy to. Just let me know. All right, quick update. Still got uh, two to zero in favor of Grand Valley against UWP. Looks relatively equal as far as number of uh, players on the court. Uh, on the center court, it's like three minutes left. 3.35 in the first half of uh, JMU versus, uh, God, Townsend, sorry, I am fading fast, uh, with a significant man advantage for JMU. Central Michigan up two points against UK. Big kill there for Saginaw. Oh, they got two there, wow. Yeah, Sag Valley definitely riding high on uh, this game. A lot of intensity, getting very pumped. Wow, man. Oh, so, there, okay, there are still two in. We got one guy kind of hanging out over in the corner. Looks like seven minutes and 40 seconds left in the game over on this court. Looks like we had a timeout called by JMU over on the middle court. And Grand Valley and UWP still fighting it out on the far court. And with that, Saginaw Valley takes their second point, a relatively quick point for them. Uh, 7.23 left in that. So